loves. Oh, I've been gone for so long. Did you miss me? Do you miss me lots? I know, I know, I know. I shouldn't stay gone that long. I should do more videos back to back. And anyways. Anyways, the second collab that we were talking about doing is has one to do with pocket letters. Ever since Linda of Linda's Thrifty Life did the pocket letter in the three or four parts, I understand it so much better. She doesn't think she did a good job. I think Linda did awesome talking, teaching, and doing a pocket letter all at the same time. I would have to stop and say, okay, do the to do, 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 and then do it and say, okay, now what I just told you to do, I did right here. Now we're going to take that and do this with it. And then I would have to do it. And then I had to talk about it again and do whatever else needed to be done and show what that part was and then do it and then show you and talk about it again. So in order for me to explain a packet letter to somebody, it would probably take me two weeks. Linda did it, I think, in part in three parts. Awesome, 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 Linda. This is for you. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. And I think Bonnie's Corner, I think she's going to help us with a new craft. I asked her to. She said she's still learning, but man, for somebody still learning, she does some awesome things. Now, I'm still learning. I am not a crafty person, but I've been trying for almost a year. And I've done some stuff, and people say it looks really nice. So it just takes me a little bit longer, but I would, you know, there's, I'd love to do different things. And Bonnie's like, I don't know if I can explain. I have faith in her. Huge amount of faith in her. I have faith in all you guys. I think you could. You can do anything you set your mind to. But I don't think it's going to be. It might not be as hard. It's not going to be as hard for some people as it is for other people. From my car accident, I do have a brain injury. So it's a lot harder for me to try to explain something to somebody. Because the words are in my mind, but they're not coming out of my mouth, or the right words aren't coming out. So, for me to teach you something, that would be a trip. I don't know, then you guys would be rolling and laughing so hard that nothing would ever get done. Alright, so, this is the second collab. Again, I would like everybody who wants to, to participate, whether you've made a pocket letter before or not, this could be your first pocket letter. I just finished my first pocket letter. I'm starting my second pocket letter and I cannot remember who it's for, but it's for, um, once I see her name, I know who she is. We're going to exchange packet letters. She said she'd love to exchange one with me. And I said, oh, I'd like to do that too. So she wants to, she didn't give me anything. She said, I just want to see what you come up with. So I think, again, next Friday, if it's not too much, get your packet letter. Get your video together saying that, yes, you would like to make a packet letter. If you want a certain kind of packet letter, then say, whoever does a packet letter for me, I would prefer a Halloween one. I would prefer a fall one. I would prefer my favorite color. If you don't specify what kind of packet letter that you're going to make, I mean, that you would like, and then, you know, you'll get whatever somebody makes for you. Now, I need opinions on this before next Friday. Should everybody just turn in that they want to participate in this collab? Should everybody write down what kind of packet letter they would like. I think that's very important, the first two. The third one is, 
should you write down who you would like to make a packet letter for? Like who you would like to exchange with? Say that Fab, I'm sorry, Fabulous Fatina, I just call her Fab, Fabby. Say that, you know, Fab wants to make one for Elsa. And then as long as they agree, Elsa make one back. And then there we go. We got their first pair. Or should we put everybody's name in a bucket and somebody pull the name out and say, first person is to do to do. Next person is to do to do to do. They're doing packet letters together and and go on and go on. The person that if we do it that way, the person that I think that should pull the names is Lisa from Lisa's Keto Kitchen. The reason I said her right off the top of my head is she does lives. She can she can go live and then we'll set this up and this will be a live video. And you will know exactly, you know, she can tell us ahead of time when the video is going to be live, what time she's going to start the video. And if you can be there, then you can be there or you have to watch the replay. Again, we're, you know, your opinions on it. That's the only two that I came up with. If anybody has anything else that would work better, you think would work better, let me know. Let Elsa know. Now, this collab. Sorry. Trying to think of Amazon. I'm expecting two things from Amazon today. I don't know if Amazon man's here or not. This collab is not like, how do I say this? Like, I, I I came up with the idea, listening to everybody talking about they want to do a pocket letter. So, it's not really my idea. It's your guys' idea. I just put it down on paper. So, I talked to Elsa about it yesterday. And she thinks that it'll be really good. And I do, too, because there's so many people that want to make packet letters. And it's going to be so many, many time, you know, first-timers. And, yes, if you're in Canada... You may participate because if you fold up a packet letter and you put it in a letter size envelope, it should not cost that much to mail at all. So then what I think you should do is send your response. Once we figure out which way we're going to partner people up, which we need to get that done in the next couple of days, especially if we want everything sent in by next Friday. Again, put it in the comments. I would like, again, everybody to make a video on this in case you have subscribers we don't have that might be interested in a packet letter. Then, everybody can send their ideas for the packet letter either to me or to Elsa through our emails so it doesn't get lost. And then between the two of us, we'll compare lists and then we'll have the list of who's participating. And then one of us will make a video. I'll probably have Elsa do that video and name off everybody who's participating. Now, I do not have any specific person that I would like to exchange a packet letter with. But... I'm making a Christmas packet letter. So, if you're interested in a Christmas packet letter, I want to make a Christmas one. That's my only... take on the, this packet letter collab, I guess. I don't know. Again, the words are... Are not coming. So, my packet letter that I make is going to be a Christmas packet letter. 
And I know people are still shopping and people are still getting together their packet letters. So packet letters aren't something that you hang on a wall. So anytime you get it, whether it's after the holiday, Halloween, Thanksgiving, and I think that we should uh, like mail them the first week of December. Then that gives everybody time to finish picking up what they need. Gives everybody time to get paired up. Gives everybody time to say what kind of packet letter they would like. Or in my case, I would like to make. And I would like to make a Christmas one. Then it gets us through Halloween and Thanksgiving before Christmas. Because I know that around Halloween, things are going to, uh, sorry, around Thanksgiving, things are going to get really busy for everybody because we're going into, you know, we're going into Thanksgiving, then we're going into Christmas, then we're going into the first of the year. And it's just like those three seem to be boom, boom, boom. Even though they're far apart, they just seem to be once, once we hit one, then they're like all lumped together. So again, I'd like you to make a video Put it out there on your page. My email is in my description box. Christina at Michigan. Christina in Michigan at gmail.com. Again, thoughts, comments, opinions. Put them underneath and we will address some. Any that I have come in, I will address. Any that Elsa has come in, she will address. And again, we'll probably make a video to address these concerns and everything. But the most important thing that you need to put on your video is, number one, I would like to make a packet letter. I would like to be a part of this. Number two, what kind of packet letter would you like? Now, it's not going to, I can't guarantee. Oh. That back of chair is going into my back. I can't guarantee that you're going to get, you know, the packet letter that you suggest. So, you know, give a couple of suggestions. And then if you would like to exchange with a specific person, Please put that down there and then we'll get in touch with that specific person and say, Elsa would like to exchange a packet letter with you. Is that okay? And if they have somebody else in mind, then we'll ask that person. So-and-so would like to exchange a packet letter with you. We'll get everybody paired up. Or just do a live and have Lisa or whoever if somebody else can do a live, let me know. Because I don't even know if Lisa would do this. I'm just throwing it out there and telling, you know, kind of saying, Hey, Lisa, guess what? You're a part of this because you can do lives and this is what you're going to do. That was just a suggestion because I know she does so many lives. And then the fourth one is get it out, get it out, get it out. Get it out to your people. Share it. Um... I'll put it on Pinterest. I've been starting a lot of boards on Pinterest for YouTubes. So, if you guys find me on Pinterest, you may be there. You may be on Pinterest. People go and look, you know, they may come over to YouTube and, and check it out. And you guys could get a whole lot of new subscribers. I don't put anything I do on Pinterest. I'm doing it for you guys. Hopefully to get you guys, to get you, you know, to get your numbers up and get you guys some new subscribers. I think that's awesome. If I missed anything, just put it down in the, you know, in the comments. Um, specific questions, especially if it's a specific question in to somebody, then either put it in the comment or I guess send them an email. That would be up to you. So let's see if we can get lots of people to participate in the packet letter. I am excited. I'm excited to make this Christmas. I have not started it. I'm excited to make this Christmas packet letter. And I still need stuff. I have some. 
but I still need some things, so I still have to go shopping, too. But like I said, I would really like to make a Christmas one, so, you know, if that interests somebody, you know, let me know, or if, or if you don't care, if somebody, you know, our names get drawn, and you, you don't care, then it'll be a Christmas. If you don't want a Christmas one, and you would like a, another specific one, nobody wants a Christmas one, then I will do that specific one. But I'm going to do a Christmas one and somebody's going to end up with it before Christmas. But somebody's going to end up with a Christmas packet letter from me. Okay. You know, you know me. I forgot something. Hang on, my love. Sorry, I had to get a drink too. Since I forgot in the, um, the wish list video, I'm going to name off some new family members. I got them down to, to three, six. I got them down to um, bunches of six. So, this one I'm just going to go ahead and do 12 since I missed it for the wish list video. And then I don't want to confuse a lot of people. And if I confuse you guys, I'm sorry. I confuse myself a lot. Okay, so our first six are Heather Womack. Hi, Heather. I'm so excited that you're here. That you're part of our family now. T Sparkle Bright. Linda Bernard Julmas. Sorry if I mispronounce your name. Roaming with Rover. Nakia Nicole, Pamela's World. Hi, Pamela. It's nice to have you here. You know, Heather, I've seen and I've heard a lot of good things about um, some of uh, the others. And then I'm noticing a lot of these when I subscribe to their channel. They're new. Some of them are very new, just like we used to be. Under 100 subscribers. New, new. So please, check out their channels. If you can help them, subscribe. You know, let's help them get their numbers up. And maybe some of their people will come over to us. And you don't have to, but if you want to say, you know, where you're coming from, that, that's fine. But you don't have to do that. I don't, I don't care about that. Then the next six are Tales of Mam, M-A-M. Hi, I know we've talked in comments before. Nicole Ocha, Matthew and Courtney's Random Adventures, Annie Mae Edwards, Regent Beauty, and Esther Plamino. It is wonderful to have you guys a part of our family. So these will be linked in the packet letter with their Who's he, what's these underneath so you can just click them and go check them out. All right, let me go get these up online so you guys can see them. And um, if you, you think I'm a fool, then tell me I'm a fool. If you think I, we shouldn't do this, then like I said, that's your opinion. But if you're going to have anything that's negative, your opinion is negative, or your opinion is going to disagree with somebody else's, which is natural, just please, 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 please be nice about it. Okay? I hope everybody participates. I'm more, I really hope more people participate in the packet letter. Then, I mean, the wish list is good, but I really hope everybody participates in the packet letter. And one of the reasons that I was talked about the wish list too, we're already almost in October and we're getting close to Christmas. And I know a lot of people are looking for the Barbie stuff for Christmas and other things. So it would be wonderful, you know, if we could help somebody out and get children, their, their kids or littles or their, you know, little grandchildren, littles, littles. Their littles as their children and their little littles as their grandchildren. If it's something that 
for Christmas for them and somebody else can get it, I think that would just be wonderful. Wonderful, 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 you know. Hey, let's put Santa out of business, okay? Who needs that man? You got mommy. You got daddy. You got grandmas. All right? You don't need Santa. You got grandmas. All right? I love you guys. Thank you for all the support. I gotta go see if my doctor emailed me back yet because as you see, this is not going anywhere. And um, I do feel a little bit better, but I, I still need something to get this completely gone out of my head. Sounds like I have helium. Yeah, Dollar Tree's out of helium because I got it all. All right, thank you for the love and support, and I love you guys. Take a look at everybody's new channels. I do have more, but take a look at their channels and see if you can give them support if it's something that, you know, you're interested in. All right, I will talk to you guys soon. I love you, love you, love you so much. Mwah. Bye, 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 my loves.